It's Friday, fool, and you need this tool. Welcome back to another glorious episode of It's Friday, Fool, You Need This Tool. My name is Kyle Voss, and every Friday I bring you a tool. A tool that is used here in this shop, or that has been featured on this channel. This week I am revisiting a tool that I've already done. Kinda. So, a long time ago, back way back when, I featured this tool here. Looks like a rivet gun. It's actually a nut cert gun or a riv nut gun. Basically it has a rivet style nut that screws onto here. You squeeze this and it will place it in a piece of sheet metal just like a rivet except well, threads on the inside. These tools are very useful. They speed up the process. You need to mount on something, you just drill a hole, you pop a riv nut in there and you're ready to go. The problem is since I did the video on this tool here, I bought a different one. One that I like much better, and that's usually the one I use on the channel. And so people are asking me, what is that tool you're using? Where do I get that? Well, I could send them to this video, but it might be kind of confusing. So I just figured, hey, I'll just do another one. So this is the Astro 1442. So this is also a riv nut gun tool. Some people call them nut certs, riv nuts. Works the same exact way. You have one of these little bad boys. It's got threads on the inside. So basically it is like a nut inside of a rivet. They make them in aluminum and steel. These ones are steel here. They actually have like a gnarled. So once you put them in place, they're gonna stay. They won't twist. And um, all you do is you take one of these, just screws right on the top. Oh, it's the wrong one. You just take one of these bad boys here, and it just screws right on the top of this thing. Just like that. And what you do is you drill a hole in your sheet metal, the, the diameter of this riv nut here. You insert that thing, give it a squeeze, just like that kind of pancakes those two layers around the sheet metal, right? And this bad boy just unscrews. This part just unscrews right here in order to get your tool back. And what you have left is a nut that is mounted in your sheet metal. This thing works awesome. I use it all the time. I recently used it on the C10, mounted some riv nuts in the bed to hold the mini chopper. And um, it's just good stuff. You don't really have to worry about the stuff coming out because really the, the action that this thing does to crimp it, well that's the action that continues to happen when you're trying to pull it out. So the actual threads are on the end of it and when you compress that thing, whatever you put on there, it's gonna be pulling on it, is just kind of reinforcing that that thing's squeezed in. This kit here comes with like 5 16 18, quarter 20, uh, 10 24, and then some of your metrics, your M5, your M6, and your M8. You can do any of those bolts. It even comes with small little packets of nut certs. And then what I do is I just buy them in bulk. This bag here is a bag of quarter 20. I tend to find that's what I use the most. So I usually have my gun set up for quarter 20 
and just kind of use that for everything that would need a nut cert. As you can see, I also keep quarter 20 button head bolts around. I tend to use these when I'm doing something that's gonna be visually appealing. You're mounting a panel or a plate and you just don't want a big bolt. I use one of these. And so I just buy these in bulk, buy the nut search in bulk. It makes my job really easy. You just pop those things in and rock on. This thing comes with a nice little case. This thing just fits right in here, just like that. Close it up, slide it away until you need it. I will drop some links in the description where you can find this kit and go check it out. This one is by Astro Pneumatic Tool Company. Works really well, I haven't had any issues with it. Definitely works better than this one does. This, this nut cert gun here is made for more of your small aluminum nut certs, whereas this one is a little more substantial and is made to mount some heavy duty nuts so you can put some big bolts in there and it can actually function like a nut wood. Nut wood? Nut wood. Nut wood. All right guys, there you go. This week's tool, the nut cert gun. Nut cert tool. As always, thank you for joining me. And uh, I'll see you guys next week. It's Friday, fool!